Good morning YouTube, welcome back to my channel, you're watching Amman here on Tour Beauty. So today I am nicely all dressed, it's nice and early actually, so I've managed to kind of just get dressed nice and early today, um, usually that never happens, but I haven't done any makeup or anything just because... I haven't um, so I'm actually about to go on a walk so I don't know why I showered before my walk I should have just showered after my walk but I just felt a little bit like I wanted to have a shower so I'll just shower or have a bath later on when I come back as well uh, but um, let me just show you guys my outfit I don't know if you guys can see it properly in this mirror let me try put this light on please excuse my lashes i actually need to order one of those little containers to just put all my lashes back i don't know why i don't have the boxes anymore i probably do i just need to find them so let me just wait for this camera to focus so i'm wearing something like super simple so i'm just wearing these oh my god can you guys see my hip dips so i'm actually working on my hip dips so hopefully these can get bigger like soon but i'm just wearing these like casual like tight joggers I can't tell you guys where I got these from because I actually can't remember I've had these for years and years and then I'm just wearing this um like wool t-shirt top from Zara and then I'm just wearing the white jacket on top um you guys know that I you guys know that I love wearing this jacket I was actually going to try wear something different but then I just felt like this went plus with the like the stripes on the type sides of the joggers I don't know why I'm all like dressy dressy but I'm just going for a walk um, on my own actually so I won't be going with anybody I've got nobody to go with because I don't think you can go with other people from a different household I don't fancy like mixing other households either just because we went through Covid so I don't want to do that so I'm actually just going to go on a walk on my own so I've just got ready and I've found a place so uh, it's still in my area so don't worry guys I'm not leaving my area but I've just found like a new woody area so I'm testing this out so I don't know how this walk's going to go so I'm just going to kind of go with the gist and kind of see what happens. Um, I'm trying to look for my little fanny pack because I don't fancy carrying my phone. I did want to vlog with my camera so I'm going to see if I can find my fanny pack and if it's big enough to hold my camera or I might just take a little bag with me because I these pockets are nothing and then I don't like to, like I like to have a little bag with me so I might see if I can find like a nice little bag that I can just pop everything into and just kind of like have my walk. Um, but yeah, so just going to go on my walk. I just thought I'll introduce the vlog and then hopefully continue for the rest of the day. I've walked eight kilometers. I'm just about to walk like back towards the house now. Um, I think I've got about a kilometer and a half left um, to go. Harvey's gonna get Nate for his nursery if I don't hurry up. Hence I'm trying to walk as fast as I can, which is making me even more out of breath. And this is what I mentioned to you guys. I love like walking or running at an earlier part of the day just because it means it's quicker and if you've done your workout earlier on in the day it usually just makes you feel good it helps with like motivation I feel like it's like a really nice detox so I always encourage people like if you are gonna do whatever fitness you're gonna do do it during the day and then if you guys will notice because you've been active during the day that detox helps you maintain a healthy like the rest of the day if obviously you start the day off and you don't get any exercise done you just spend the rest of the day being really sluggish as well and not wanting to do anything so it's really nice like now when I'll go home I feel more motivated wanting to do things and even with like eating I feel like it helps with like wanting to eat cleaner for the rest of the day as well um, so 
yeah. Oh, I still haven't closed all my rings. Obviously, I can't close my stand goal just yet because I've got to be up for 12 hours. But I have closed my exercise goal and I think it's gone around three times. But I still haven't closed my cows yet because I haven't like burnt enough calories. Walking doesn't burn a lot of calories for me. I've got to do a really heavy run in order to burn the calories. But yeah. Hey guys, I feel like I look so nice and fresh today. I think it's only because my hair, I hairsprayed my hair today just to make it really nice and flat. I think that's why I feel nice and fresh. Um, but yeah, so I actually forgot to put my moisturizer on today. So I did my skincare. I did the ones for my eyes. And then I also did the face and then that's it. Actually talking about that, so my mum has like suddenly started getting lots of pigmentation on her face. Uh, this was about a year ago and her face went really dark from here. And it's been about a month, yeah, just about a month or maybe even under a month. But my mum started taking this thing called Well Woman. Now you guys might have, might have heard of Well Women, it's by Vitabiotics. But my mom has been taking well women and obviously i haven't seen my parents or anyone for ages but um there's like some pr packages and things like that i get uh, ordered to my mom's house just because i don't want to give my address away so i get a lot of stuff to send to my mom so i went to their door today to go pick up a few things and when i went to my mom's i saw that her face has really cleared up and her face looked really really fresh so i asked my mum i was like what have you done like what have you done what have you taken and she literally just said to me she goes she's taken nothing she's done nothing um she's actually stopped taking like stopped doing this skincare stuff so she was using this these like products that you know you get them little you know you get people trying to sell you stuff like oh we've done a side business would you like to buy this so I think someone had mentioned about some side business to her so um, that's the product she was using and she'd been using that for about five or six years but she stopped doing that and she said all I apply is Nivea cream and I take my well women and now because her body body's got all of the like the the vitamins it's got all of those things that it requires her skin's automatically done well so it's on obviously it's like things like that we need our vitamins we need our, like our vitamin d we, we need all of our vitamins to have this so i was actually thinking about it today i really do suffer with a lot of fatigue and stuff like that so i've still got some of my postpartum um vitabiotics so i was thinking i might just finish my those guys can you guys see some bags as well so i'm gonna finish those and then I've also got some cod liver tablets. I'm going to finish those as well. Once I finish all of those, I will just go on to the normal kind of well women vitabiotics as well. So I was thinking I'm going to have a look and I'm going to take some of those as well because her skin really, really went quite well. But yeah, so I'm just going to like driving back from my mum's and um, I don't know if I've mentioned it to you guys before, but we don't have a local McDonald's to our house. And I was about to get off and I kind of just forgot my junctions. I haven't driven to my mum lots in such a long while. I haven't really been driving around. I haven't really been going anywhere. So I was like, I need to get off here. And then my brain told me it's not here. You need to get off at the next one. And when I went to the next one, I realized that this wasn't the one I was meant to get on off from the one before. So it happens that I can't get any McDonald's, which is probably good anyways, because I mean, I did a beautiful, nearly 10 kilometer walk so my overall total came to just under 10 kilometers like 9.87 kilometers so i think it's a good thing that i didn't um, get mcdonald's so now i'm just thinking what am i going to eat when i get home um we've just got loads of scraps left actually we haven't got like proper food food we've just got loads of little scraps um i've got a lot of chicken actually so um before this chicken goes out of date because what i do is i some some chickens if i've used a little bit of it i take half of it out and put it to the side so i believe i've got a chicken breast but i believe that probably has gone out of date so i'm gonna have to chuck that one chicken breast and i'm, I'm really sorry guys like i really know that wasting food is really bad and i very rarely ever waste food so i am gutted about that 
but I think I'm gonna open the other chicken packet tonight and I might just make me and Jeggy some chicken or I'll have a look at what we make, something a little bit healthier. <laughs> like what on earth was I editing because this screen is off this is actually connected to my work laptop and let me show you guys and let me show you guys so that is connected to my work laptop over here and I use my MacBook Air to edit my videos so I was just editing my videos at here but yeah so look at little Tesco supermarket in the background but since we got back we've just been lazy actually so Avi was a little bit irritated um, I think just because she spent like the majority of the day out so when we got home Avi did not want to go like to her grandparents she just kind of wanted me and plus she was tired so she just wanted milk and to go to sleep so I just kind of took her upstairs I thought it was like the easiest way to put her to sleep um, so remember we said to you guys that she's a thumb sucker, well we tried to give her the dummy, she did take the dummy as well, and I don't like giving kids a dummy, I never did with my first, um, so now basically she stopped sucking her thumb because she got out of the dummy phase, but then she liked the sensation of a dummy, so obviously um, now I've put her onto my breast again. <laughs> So I I don't put her on my breast often, but I've just been kind of um, breastfeeding her, um, basically just to soothe her to sleep, so she won't have she won't thump, suck her thumb and she won't require anything. But she's very good. Like she she never has the urge of having a dummy, which is brilliant. Um, but yeah, so I've just been kind of breastfeeding her. So I just took her upstairs for a little while. But yes, yeah, so um, she's quite good like that. So yeah, so I took her upstairs and I just gave her a nap. Um, please do excuse, you guys won't see today's, well, like, until everything is over. I really wish, like, I could speak to you guys in the present tense. Um, probably, like, on an Instagram would be so much better, but I don't know whether all of you guys on YouTube follow me on my Instagram so I can give you my updates, so let me know if you guys do, because then I will start giving you guys all updates on my Instagram, which will just be perfect. Um, but yeah, so I basically, the Lori vlog I had was about 20 minutes, so it's 21 minutes in total for just like the first one day, I actually vlogged a lot on this day, um, well not a lot, I just probably did more talking to be honest, so I thought instead of doing two, like one whole chunky video of 45 minutes, 45 minutes yeah basically it was better if I just did two videos and I'm just going to do one lolly part and a second lolly part if the second one's a little bit shorter I don't care and then usually I always do a video miss a day a video miss a day a video but then now I just thought you know what I'm liking vlogging I am vlogging quite a lot so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to continue vlogging on the day to day or yeah just continue vlogging on the day to day if I miss a day it's okay if I miss a moment that's okay but I'm just going to continue vlogging and then that way, even if I do upload consecutively, it's okay because then if I do have a bit of a pause, I'll just put vlogs in there and then I'll just chuck in other videos. So I've also got a makeup tutorial which I still need to finish editing, but because I've just been editing so many vlogs, I just haven't edited it. So probably this Sunday, once I clear up the backlog, because my laptop is actually a MacBook Air, um, I do want to buy a new laptop or a new computer, but just not yet. But um, because my MacBook Air, the capacity isn't a lot, I think the maximum videos I can edit at once is probably always two. So, yeah. So I'm just currently exporting this. There wasn't a lot of edits to do because yesterday I edited majority of this video. So this one is ready. I'm just going to begin uploading this. Um, so at least this way when Jeggy and Harvey come home this evening, we pretty much don't have... I like I won't be on my own kind of like editing videos I can just kind of chill with them as well Avi is currently in her high chair she's just having some crisps um 
yeah, she's just having her, like, just a snack thing. I think my in-laws aren't getting into grips with the fact that, um, I think, how can I explain it? Like, um, I'm a very different type of person. Like, me and my brother are very different. Like, he's one of those people, if you make a mess, you make a mess. Like, your kids pick it up, it's fine. I'm the person, I'm like, I'm going to teach my kids, like, not to make a mess. I don't like, I've been often been to family, friends' houses where they've just got, like, kids and they've got mess on the floor and the floor's not been mopped. I'm not like that. So as soon as, like, Avi or Harvey, like, if Harvey never drops anything, he's such a clean baby, like, kid. Uh, Avi, if she'll drop something, I'll be there. I don't care if it's 10pm, but I'll get my vacuum and I'll vacuum it. I know it's a bit OCD, but... Little crumbs and stuff, I just believe, like, they should just eat in their high chair, to be honest. So I think my in-laws are kind of getting in grips with that. So the fact that she's sitting in a high chair right this moment, they're like, why? So I'm like, because I'm mumming. Um, that's just the way it is. Harvey's learned to be very well-mannered. Um, he doesn't drop crumbs everywhere. He's really good. And I think it's just the fact that they don't have any kids to compare. I mean, they have, like, loads of kids to compare, like, my kids with. So... For example, like my sister-in-laws, they all have kids. Two of them are from back home, so obviously back home you can just make an utter mess. And then the third one, she is from back home, but she's in Canada, so again, she doesn't really care either. So she just lets her kids make a mess as well. So I think they compare mine to hers, and then I'm very disciplined and they're not, so I think it kind of just... They don't seem to understand of it. Luckily, I have Juggy, who always says, it's okay, Amman's right, <laughs> Amman does this. Because I think Juggy just learned to be OCD with me now. Yeah, he is very OCD, actually. He is very cleaning as well. Like, even when we wash the dishes, he'll automatically come and empty the washing box, like the, the dish rack, because we don't like anything in the dish rack, which, yeah remembering of that I need to ask someone to do something in the kitchen as well so again my everyday list I've got my list I'm just crossing off everything on my list um by the time you guys will see this video you guys uh, I will already have my journal so my journal comes tomorrow so as soon as my journal comes I will show you guys but I ordered a um law of attraction journal like diary so I'm super excited the photos didn't really seem clear of the things inside there but it seemed like the best one I went through about four or five on Amazon so it's going to be really good I can't wait to show you guys I still haven't started to read my book which I am going to start tomorrow I've just got a few quotes to read of the Charlotte Freeman book which I want to read and then I will do it right now this is about 18 minutes and 51 seconds so I am gonna well not me talking um you guys have got a bit of a time lapse in there as well but I've been talking for about five minutes literally so I'm gonna shut this off and speak to you guys soon are you being a drama queen nah. yeah yeah so Abby's been a bit of a drama queen she keeps opening the desk I've got some makeup stuff here because since moving here I think I've mentioned to you guys before I haven't got a like a real home to store my makeup in what? hi 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 yeah, so I haven't got a home to store my actual makeup in and I've got loads and loads of makeup palettes and I've got um, lots of brushes. One second. Look, look, look. So we're having a dilemma with our kids. Harvey, Harvey is colouring over there with his daddy and this little diva, here she goes. Obviously she's walking faster and faster as the days go along. Is crying because she wants to do some colouring as well. Ow, you don't poke me. Oh. Don't poke me in the eye. Here you go. Oh, oh. But you've got to let him colour. Oh. Come on, let's do something else. Here, let's type. Here, you can do this. Not the mouse, but you can do this. Okay, so I was going to show you guys she calmed down. 
I gave her one of Harvey's little Spider-Man books, but clearly not. And now this is a drawer she likes to go into for some makeup. Up too long. Hi guys. So I'm actually using my phone light to give me some lighting. Can you guys see this really brings out the bags? And don't even ask me what hairstyle I did. You see my shadow? Yeah. Don't even. Ah. Oh. And my shadow. <laughs> so we're currently just watching The Hobbit, the first one. We've never seen The Hobbit, believe it or not. So we're actually just watching it, but it's hard to kind of watch it because both the kids are surrounding me.